So now let's start with the price or application. Um, this application, one of the main applications in our system, because many, everybody want to control prices. <laughs> <clears throat> so here is some brief information about last contracts, last promotion, last hotel contracts and last services. And that in this application you can manage hotel rates and uh, rates for services and some other options that I will describe later. So, uh, just for just in case if you know a name of hotel, you don't need to search it here in uh, in this tree. This tree is separated by by countries. You can just fill in this small form. and select hotel that you want to find. For example, this hotel. What do we have here? We, c we have here two contracts, two hotel contracts with the two different su suppliers. Uh, you can see brief and form about these contracts and uh, you can simply enter to this contract by pressing desired contract. Here is uh, prices, rates and brief information about contracts. So here is no promotions, no special price offers, no extra services and no cancel options. Uh, if you want to edit some of option hodl you we can here is some fast buttons for example you want to edit price of this contract you are entering price here is prices prices are in us dollars if you want to change you can change for example, your, your prices in euros or else. And um, here you can see OK. OK, that means fast, fast check. What does it mean? If you have, for example, if you will enter a room rate for double less then for single here will be warning and for example if you enter for triple room price that less so you can see also warning And um, if you want to clear some some row, for example, this row, you can just press over here. OK, this values is cleared. OK, also you can clear here. OK, so, but, but uh, until you press button save, it is uh, uh, prices are not not saved. Even if you go to other tab, prices won't be saved, and uh, every uh, every edit that you made will lost. But we don't need to fix it. We just uh, I will show you options tab. Options tab, it's where, it's a place 
where you can change this table of options so here you can see seasons seasons can consist can uh, contain more than one period for example if you have some additional period you can add it here let's say we need from 1st of November Save. So we just extended our rates till the the thirtieth of November, and here you can find some information about who's updated contract. Here is meals of. Uh, of hotel contract so you can add some additional meals for example HB FB you can leave it blank but in case if in hotel using some um, some how to say additional ad additional meal name for example HB HB Gold. So we, as you can see, when you, if you le leave it blank, it's just copying from default meal. From default meal data. To set up meals you can go to data catalog and here on services you can find meals accommodations as much as you want service types tour types and price types but these options we will discuss later. Let's get back to our options. So we have, if we, if we press on the price uh, tab, we can see here is additional uh, additional rows for this contract. So you can fill in here uh, rates for HB and FB. So going back to options, here is the rooms. At the left, at the right part, you can see all the rooms in the hotel, which is in, which, which are managing in the catalog. So in catalog, we are adding rooms with descriptions, with uh, images. Uh, we are setting uh, how many how many rooms in the hotel so every everything that we need for this description but here on the left part here is only contract rooms so uh, that rooms uh, that are corresponding to your catalog rooms uh, it in 99 percent of cases they have same names but in case if uh, you have for example, del deluxe room, first floor, um, but in uh, in description you don't have you don't want to to describe this deluxe room first floor because it is the same with uh, deluxe room second floor, <coughs> but it is but it has a different price. So here we add uh, rooms for contract. We can delete it and also we can add it here, over here. But in case if we don't have any room times in our catalog, we can simply add it from here. Just add room type and every option you can set up here. 
And the uh, final option is accommodations. Accommodations, how many accommodations we have? It, we are sitting here, over here. For example, if we have accommodation in some room, uh, four packs, we edit from here, just press save and options will will be set automatically for from accommodation which is taken from from here from data data application data accommodation so number of adults adults number of children number of seats will be will be set automatically and also we are setting here uh, child ages. They are they aren't setting in uh, in here. So, for example, if we look at every child accommodation, there there is no no ages. You can set ages here. Ages are setting in. Uh, in options of hotel in contract here you can set can set default ages for example you have some some different uh, accommodations with with child and you don't want to enter every time from 2 till 11 <coughs> 11 means 11.99 so until 12 Uh, you can just set it over here as edit and here you can also set some public information but it's not necessary it's never using actually so better forget about it <laughs> so as as we add some additional options for example four packs we can add prices here <clears throat> what does it mean special price offer for example hotel send you special price price offer which is which has a limited valid validity and um, just for some room when you add in special price offer, active special price offer, it's over, um, it's overload uh, your actual prices and uh, using uh, new prices. For example, you have some special price offer for deluxe room in uh, period from first of August till 31st of August with minimum stay seven nights that is also can be set and uh, only for the lux room for for BB rate let's say 100 okay safe so now we have special price offer for this period and uh, also you can set here validity of this uh, special price offer for example booking window let's say we are can book uh, this pressure special price offer only from now day till the end of july or for example we have ebb option so for example, this option, uh, this special price offer is valid only for bookings made uh, prior 60 days.
but 60 days is for, the, for this case is too much because only 8 days left. If you want to see all special price offers, just click over here or over here and you can see summary. If special price offer is not active or you don't want it or you don't want to use it anymore, just deactivate it in one click. Uh, next up is promotions. It is very powerful and uh, very complex part of contract. So we have many type of promotions, five types actually. Um, starting from simple type, we call it marketing type, uh, with uh, that is that cases when you receive. Uh, promotion from hotel just free massage or free dinner which can be priced <coughs> which is not not uh, not evaluate for prices anywhere and um, second type is uh, stay pay promotion then uh, discount promotion then upgrade promotion and package promotion. So let's add some promotion. For example, we don't we don't need simple. Simple it's okay. We just add simple and fill in description here. For example, free massage. But we don't need it, we need stay pay promotion. Here is the names, public name, it's for your clients. And if same using supplier you can leave it just blank. So dates of stay. We have to specify here, for example, for August. Uh, period can be some options. Whole period, it, that means accommodation must be, uh, must be, must start and end in this period. Check-in date, that means that uh, check-in date must must be in this period. So if check-out will be, if check-in will be at uh, 30, 31st of uh, August and check-out will be uh, at uh, 7th of uh, September, uh, promotion will be valid. And uh, check-out date same, but check-out must be in this period. <coughs> But we recommend most strict is whole period. Booking means like a booking window. It's a period of validity. For example, we this this promotion valid from today till the end of July. If there is no there is no limitations of uh, booking uh, date, dates of booking, just leave it blank. Uh, here you can set up <coughs> mini minimum and maximum uh, stay. For example, only 14 nights, not more. Uh, here you can set up if there is another promotion which is can be combinable with, which can com combine with uh, this promotion, you can uh, choose it here, but we don't have any other promotions, so here is nothing. And uh, here active, we need to press 
if this promotion is active. If not active, uh, you this won't be countable. <clears throat> so save. We just added promotion and now we can add some options. For example, stay 5, pay 3, stay 7, pay 5, stay 9, pay 6. And here is limitations only for special room, for example, only for deluxe room or only for special accommodation, only for double accommodation if this promotion, so other accommodation won't count this promotion uh, what does it mean base? base, uh, for example, uh, we we need to count price difference between uh, for three days uh, with some base accommodation. Uh, for example, we have deluxe room, which is base for us, and we have uh, second uh, grand room, which is uh, uh, ex more expensive th than deluxe room. So for three days, we mu we must count price difference between these rooms. So we just choose deluxe room and when we count promotion for grand room uh, program will count a difference between prices and add it like supplement on three days. Same with meals and accommodations. So for example we have base accommodation double and uh, we count triple accommodation so program we will count difference for price cost of uh, double and triple and add it on free day, days as supplement. Other ways, other way to specify supplement is to add it manually. So for example, we have we need to uh, add some bad tax on free days. We type in bad tax and there is 20 US dollars per adult and 10 US dollars per per night per box if you choose per night per room so only this one will be will be calculated this option means that um, free nights will be cut from end. And this option means that we can multiply. Multiply means uh, if we have stay 5, pay 3, then if we stay 10, we will pay 6. If we stay 15, we will pay 9. So that's all. Let's save it. In case if you want to to multiply some some similar option, you can copy it. So we'll we'll copy with same options. But I want to show you this option. This option is nonsense. So we have we normally we setting uh, or only options or base options. So this one is uh, not really correct so we will set in case if you have uh, option which is <coughs> which is ac actual for all type of all type of accommodation and all type of rooms and all type of meals you just leave blank and you don't uh, need any supplements for free nights. You just leave blank every additional option. And that's all. Save. So this time of option means that we can multiply these options and option and 
it will be available for every room. So, next one useful promotion is discount. Discount it's very useful for EBB <coughs> early bird bookings. For example, EBB thirty percent. Dates stay let's say in September. Adding and adding some options over here. For example, we have 30% discount we are setting in persons. If we set here days before, that will be EBB. Hmm. For example, one month, one month, uh, 30 days. And here is also limitations. For example, we can set it only for special room, only for deluxe room. This is available. Or if you choose uh, known, so every room will be count this discount. And also base facilities as uh, in uh, stay pay options. So for days that will count this discount will be uh, it is possible to add some extra payment for example we we are discounting uh, 30 percent but we need to count upgrade for example between uh, grand room and deluxe room uh, program will count discount 30 percent and add upgrade so price difference between rooms rooms rate save and also we can add supplements for that for that peri peri period of discount so we have 6 day discounts uh, we will add uh, price we, we we can add some supplement for example taxes Ten dollars. Supplements are must be in the same currency as in contract over here. So, next time, next type of promotion, we can uh, see here that this promotion is not active. Um, as you can see, promotions here are located in priority type. Priority type. As you can see, promotions here are located located in priority type. So first, we'll count first program will count this promotion, and second program will count this promotion. If they are can't can't be combinable, <coughs> so program will count only first. If you want to change change priority, just use these buttons. But in this case, we have different uh, dates of stay, so this promotion can be can be intersected. So next useful type of promotion is uh, upgrade. Upgrade. Let's say we have a great promotion for October. Minimum stay seven nights, maximum fourteen. Active, save. Upgrade means that we are upgrading some type of uh, option 
we can upgrade uh, room, upgrade meal or room and meal. For example, we have room upgrade from hotel. So in this period, every bookings that hotel receive for a room, deluxe room, will be upgraded for grand room. Minimum stay must be seven nights. Save. If you have room and meal upgrade, meal, same situation, you just from BB to HB Gold, every booking will be upgrade. Minimum seven nights. Room and meal, every booking for Grand Room will be upgraded to Honeymoon Grand. No minimum stay required and uh, BB will be upgraded for HB. So that's all. Going back to all promotions. So we've done a lot of... Here is some brief description of this promotion. This is auto description, which is coming from uh, options. And uh, next useful... Promotion is package promotion. for September. Ten fourteen. Deep save. What does it mean? Package means that for some period uh, for if you booking deluxe room with a double accommodation with meal BB for seven nights this room will be count for thousand which is much cheaper than we have if, if we count it uh, by contract. Also we have, we, we can include in this package some additional amenities like free massage or spa or free dinner. It's, it's uh, some kind of marketing promotion but uh, this uh, promotion affecting price price, uh, final price. So that's all. Simple, if you add simple promotion, that that promotion won't affect any price. That promotion, promotion just add uh, uh, some amenities when you're booking. So next tab is an extra tab which is useful for extra services of hotel. Uh, most popular extra services it's New Year Gala. Dinner. St 
120 US dollars for adults, for example, and 60 dollars for child. So here is count type option. Uh, per night, per day, once, twice can be used. For example, if we set ah, and uh, here is very, very popular option comp compulsory. Compulsory means that <clears throat> in process of booking, this uh, extra service will be count automatically and will be <coughs> add in final, final invoice automatically. Save. Uh, what does it mean account type? Uh, for example, we can add some meal if we don't we if we don't uh, want to add it in contract, but we have price for it. For example, for dinner, no? yes, for dinner, and uh, this is for. whole period of contract we can add dinner in hotel with this rate it's not compulsory and this rate is per night per night uh, nights will uh, nights is uh, always less than days for one for example, if we have seven nights, that that will be eight days. If we set up once, it useful for, for example, <coughs> for some transfers or for, uh, for example, uh, Chinese New Year is uh, continuing for, continuing for one week, but only once in in this week uh, will be will be some gala dinner for client so uh, this uh, extra option will will count only once in this period safe name for supplier can be different and uh, this name is using for bookings So next tab is cancel options. You can simple import all periods from system and set up default values. <coughs> Days before penalty type one night. So that means for every period that we have in our system for cancellations made uh, before seven nights, will system will count one night penalty. But for example, for higher period, for nowadays we have different type of penalty. For example, full cost that means hundred percent for 14 days cancellations but it's there is really hard cancellation condition and you can set it only you can set add cancellation with uh, some value for example 100 USD for For November, oh, sorry, for hundred USD. That means nights. Nice. 
in case if we have some intersections system will show us so we have two deep different types of cancellations in this period so one of them better delete um, next tabs we will look at next tabs we will discuss in the next lessons in quarter lessons uh, here I can show you useful tab count so if you want to count some accommodation for 10 nights to adults you just can update here you can find some information about promotion that used and here is full cost full cost you you can also add some markup for example 20 20 percent and system will count your rate with markup so next case I will show you how to add new contract for some hotels for, for new hotel for example some hotel that we made in our previous previous lesson so we can find it over here you can see this hotel is gray that means that no contracts for this hotel is uh, at the moment green means that hotel has a contract and ho contract is uh, valid at the moment and yellow means hotel, hotel has contract but contract is not valid at the moment expired or not active so here is our sum hotel and here is our sub layers that can be sub layers for Bali uh, that means that these sub layers has their global contracts in Indonesia how to add global contracts uh, for sub layers I showed you on the previous lesson partners so let's add some hotel contract to Maestra Tools so we just pressed one button and we have blank contract no options so let's add season with uh, for August for example save and uh, one meal save and we already have three rooms just we left only one rooms only one room standard room and uh, add some accommodations single uh, double double blues child and uh, triple save we have automatically every every option set it so we now we have options for adding prices price single hundred you can use arrows on keyboard to navigate hundred and hundred hundred and twenty hundred and twenty save so that's that's all that simple contract on the page all contracts you can see this simple contract summary so in case if we have another another contract <coughs> here so 
these contracts will be shown here. So I guess that's all for today. Thank you.